OneNote gives me lots of flexibility for storing the wide variety of information I gather as part of my job. I can set up a logical organization beforehand, such as chronologically or by project. Or I can just dump everything I want to save into one place. Sooner or later, I usually end up putting my notes in order, arranging them in a way that works best for me. Let me show you how I do it. When I want to tighten up or create more space in my notes pages, I can easily move notes containers by dragging them around on the page. And I can rearrange pages and sections in the same way. Another way to move a page to a different section of my notebook is by right-clicking the Page tab, pointing to Move Page To, and selecting a location. Sometimes I get really busy and don't get around to organizing the information I've gathered. I'll click the Unfiled Notes section icon at the bottom of the navigation bar, and here's all the information I've gathered from the web and from other programs by using the OneNote Side Note window. If I forget where this or any other information is, OneNote gives me several ways to find it again. For example, I often categorize my notes by marking them with tags, like the ones you see here. To do this, I simply click in the Note, go to the Insert menu, point to Tag, and pick a tag. Or I can simply click the Tag icon on the navigation bar and select from the drop-down menu. Now let's say I want to see all the notes I've tagged as important, as indicated by the yellow star. I go to the View menu and click All Tagged Notes. And here they are, all the notes I have tagged as important. When I want to find information that I haven't marked with a tag, I can search for it. I type the text I want to find here in the search box, such as the name of a client. Then I click the search icon. OneNote highlights every instance of the text it finds in all of my notebooks, even when it's in handwritten ink, text embedded within pictures, or spoken in an audio recording. I can review the results by clicking the arrows to move through the pages containing the text, or I can click View List to see the list of search results in the task pane. I can sort the list by date, by section, or by page title. When I click an entry in the list, I'm taken to that particular notes page. That's my favorite thing about OneNote. I can organize the notes I gather, or I can just pile them up on a few pages to order them when I feel like it. But no matter how organized I choose to get, there's no chance of losing information. With OneNote, I can always find the information I want when I want it.